Hello and welcome to another episode of Tips and Ideas with Ed Wallace of Midwest Landscaping, www.uniqueenvironments.com. We're here in South Orange County, California, doing a landscape makeover, where we're going to take the existing landscape, which was used to be, all this area used to be all green lawn area, and we're going to convert over to a water-conserving uh, California native and California friendly landscape with shrubs, ground cover, mulch, and a decomposed granite pathway. This area here where we have the vendor board already framed out is where the pathway is going to go. It's going to lead around the fountain all the way over to the backyard gate, over to another area where the clients want to develop a sitting area. And one thing that's pretty unique about this sitting area is we retrofitted the existing pop-ups with a filter, a pressure regulator filter right here. And we branched out with a rainbow copper shield subsurface tubing that we used to go around to create a watering system for this tree, this uh, birch tree. And here is our clean out plug over here. So when that system comes on, we'll be able to get this tree watered because there will be decomposed granite in this area here but our tree will be able to get water subsurfacely with the rainbow copper shield tubing and uh, speaking of retrofit we retrofitted quite a few heads where there were heads located in different areas to adequately water the lawn we moved those heads over to uh, the perimeters of the edging uh, there was heads up close to the fountain uh, body and we moved those out so we move about five heads out we're going to raise these drains up with couplers and tubing so that they will be able to meet the height that we're going to put in for the decomposed granite we have a guy coming in to redo the stucco because the water damage from uh, watering the lawn over the years has caused considerable stucco damage to the fountain so before we put in the decomposed granite there's going to be a asbestos comes out and takes care of that stucco work for us we also went through and retrofitted out quite a few of the shrub heads uh, with uh, the valvet system in stem flow regulators, little toughy uh, uh, valve stems. And um, these stems be able to regulate the amount of water that's coming through the valves and save some water uh, through the stems uh, and be able to save some water by cutting back the amount of water that's being thrown out. But these these shrub heads are very efficient in helping us to reduce the amount of water that we're going to use here on the property. And also the pop-ups will be retrofitted out to little toughy four inch pop-ups in order to accurately water the shrubberies that's going to be installed in the landscape ground cover that's going to be installed into the property. There also will be a ground cover, um, um, landscape mulch ground cover for the different areas around the plants and shrubs. And um, that's about it. Right now, we're at the prep area, prep stage of the of the job site. I went through and redid all the shrub heads with the valve system shrub adapters. We have an adjustment screw that'll go in on the side where we can be able to adjust the volume of water that comes out and really be able to regulate how we're gonna water our landscape. There will be uh, Toro precision rotating heads rotating uh, sprinkler nozzles so we're going to use and also toral precision nozzles that we'll use on the job site to help us reduce the amount of water help us save approximately 35 to 40 percent on our watering but this is our project here in um, south orange county california and one thing i forgot to point out that i'll point out quite right quick is uh, before we put down our decomposed granite we do have a landscape fabric that we're installing <laughs> And one thing about the landscape fabric, do buy quality landscape fabric. Don't buy the cheap stuff that you can rip with your hand. This particular landscape fabric has fiberglass filament in it. And be sure to use the square headed stakes and not the round head stakes. These round headed stakes are basically used for irrigation piping, like what you see over here. So the round ones are for the irrigation pipe and these square ones are basically to mount to still be flush to the ground when we put in the landscape fabric. But the landscape fabric will be on in all the pathway before we put down our decomposed granite. So stay tuned and watch the magic. Ed Wallace, Midwest Landscaping. Tips and ideas. 
www.uniqueenvironments.com.